Greetings and salutations, David Duford here, DeFord Insurance Group. Thank you for watching. Please make sure you subscribe and like to my channel and like this video. If you like this kind of content, I really appreciate it. So what you're about to watch here is just a little bit of a segment in a recording I did with Luis Moreno, my Medicare Advantage sales and marketing trainer. Uh, I am involved heavily, not only in final expense, but Medicare. It's a growing division in my organization. I'd like to invite you to learn more about how selling Medicare is a great opportunity to add income to your insurance sales business, not just on a high income basis, but a passive renewal driven basis. Medicare pays a lifetime renewal, and it's incredible after you accumulate a lot of Medicare uh, clients, the kind of income that you can get from making work that you did many years in the past. And this is especially complimentary if you already sell final expense. So you wanna stick around to this. If you're looking for a way to develop passive income, you wanna write more business if you're already out there and, and want to learn of an incredible opportunity that maybe you don't know much about. So stick around, check it out. And if you're interested in learning more about how our system works, I got a link above and below that will take you to more uh, links and information, all that stuff. So check it out if you wanna learn more about how it works. So thank you for watching. Okay, so Luis, um, you know, we use a lot of different strategies to uh, come or develop uh, Medicare prospects. And one of the ones we use is using the low income subsidy strategy. Can you kind of tell us what the LIS or low income subsidy strategy is and uh, why agents that are selling Medicare Advantage should care about it? So the biggest thing, and, and we use a lot of acronyms in this, and LIS, and you'll hear us agents. So when you hear the term LIS, we're referring to low income subsidy. And what it really is, it is the extra help with prescription drugs. So what it does for seniors, and this is why it is so important, is that it helps seniors with their prescription drugs. You know, just, just what it says, it's extra help. So it does a couple of things. When we talk about the prescription uh, portion of Medicare, there are four buckets or four stages. There is a deductible stage, where they could pay a deductible for, for prescriptions, not all of them, but certain tiers. There's the initial coverage stage where they're gonna pay co-pays for their prescriptions. There's the dreaded donut hole where when they get into this stage, they're having to pay 25% of the medication, the, the, the cost of the medication. And then the fourth stage is the catastrophic stage, which a lot of seniors never get to because they can't get out of stage three, which is a donut hole. They got to spend over $6,000 and it's just not going to happen. It's not in their budget. So this is where LIS comes in or the extra help. So we've got to qualify the seniors. We've got to make sure that their income and their assets are, are, are within the limits. And if they are within the limits, you can help them apply. Now applying is going to do two things for them. Number one, if on the deductible, it's gonna wipe that away. Number two, the co-pays that they normally have are gonna get wiped away and they're gonna pay LIS co-pays, which could be either uh, no premium or no copay, a dollar in change, $3 in change, maybe $9 in change, okay? For the highest tier medication. So it really helps them out there. And then here's the biggest benefit. And this is where I tell, uh, agents. This is life-changing, in my opinion, for seniors, because in the donut hole, two things happen. They use all their money to pay for the drugs, or they quit taking them because they can't afford it. And then, and then it, it's a negative spiral. At that point, they stop taking the drugs, their health deteriorates, and, it, and, and it, it's not a good thing. When they're at, having LIS will get rid of that donut hole. And that is huge. The other thing that it does, potentially if these seniors have a penalty that they're paying because they enrolled late in a part D plan, LIS will also pick that up. It's rare, there's not a lot of seniors. Most of them are, are pretty on time and are not experiencing that late enrollment. But I think, or that late enrollment penalty, but I think the biggest savings or the biggest thing that we can do for seniors that, that meet the income and the asset levels. And it's not very much, but if they meet those asset and income levels, life-changing as far as prescriptions are concerned. 
so we really can help someone out right out the gate in a big way. And and the other thing too, that qualification from LIS makes you eligible for a special election period, right? For Medicare Advantage plans. I'm glad you brought up. That wasn't even, I wasn't even mentioned that, but yes. Now, if you don't have that special election to get them in, you've just created one for yourself. Beautiful. Okay. And, and here's another thing, because David, I know a lot of your agents are dealing with final expense. Now, if some of these seniors are paid higher co-pays for meds, and now you just put them into the LIS program, you just freed up some money for final expense. Yeah. Okay. And they should have final expense. They got to have that, that, that those funds for, you know, I, I tell my seniors, you, you know, it's not really a problem for you. You know, you're, you're gone. You passed. It's a problem for your kids. You know, you don't want to burn you because you should have a little something enough just to bury you. You know, if, if you have enough funds to leave a little something, well, great. But you don't want to create that burden. And so now with LIS, you potentially have that ability to free up some funds for that product. And guys, and, and when we, if you're a new agent to Medicare and you're kind of doing your due diligence, a lot of you watching this video are considering Medicare. This is how we're able to teach our agents to sell Medicare Advantage all year long. Uh, we utilize strategies like the low income subsidy uh, strategy to uh, trigger special election events, which give us the opportunity to sell Medicare Advantage plans off season because these clients are below the poverty level. In many cases, they need our help and they also potentially need a better Medicare Advantage plan. So this is how we turn this great renewal stream based product that most people sell just at the end of the year into a year round venture. Correct, correct. And, and I will tell you, here's the other beautiful thing of this. It takes less than five minutes to complete that LIS enrollment. I mean, it, it's a no brainer. I mean, you go to the social security website I mean, it's literally click, click. You start entering some data, five minutes, you're done. So okay. definitely agents, you should be doing this for your seniors.